One, two, three, say Kara's pregnant. Hi, um, my name is Kara Laybourne and a couple years ago I was there very briefly for um, a pregnancy and I just took a test yesterday and found out that I am pregnant again and I was trying to figure out what the next step to be. What? Oh, thank you. <laughs> I was just trying to figure out what the next step would be for um, establishing care. So after feeling crummy and just super nauseous and just exhausted uh, for a few days and after complaining about it for a while Jeff convinced me that I should probably take a test so yesterday I woke up at around 4 30 and went and took a test obviously as you've seen the test was positive so we are expecting another kid um, not planned by any means uh, we were actually considering planning to start trying this December so it's not like a huge major deal or shock or anything it's just again we had no control over the timing or anything it just happened we were not doing anything to make it happen but yet here we are again I just got off the phone with uh, the hospital doctor whatever you want to call it the reception with my hospital and set up my appointment to get a dating ultrasound but as it is right now from the information that I have and gave them they say my estimated due date is May 3rd which is a little bit earlier than Isaiah's but at the same time all the math for everything it looks exactly like Isaiah's and my cycle is funky so I'm guessing more than likely it's going to be closer to June than May but we'll see still kind of just in shock of all this. I haven't told my parents yet which we are living with so I'm trying to figure out how I want to tell them. I'm obviously going to tell them but I wanted to do something cool but I don't think I'm I think I'm just kind of telling. That's what I've just ended up with everybody is just telling. Jeff obviously basically already knew because he was the one that told me to take a test so I didn't get to do anything fun there. But yeah, looks like Isaiah's gonna be getting a sibling. I'm not going to post this for a while, so basically this video is just gonna be a collection of things up until the point where I want to reveal it to you guys, so it's gonna be a little bit random, but that's what I normally do, apparently. Okay, ready? Okay. One, two, three, say Kara's pregnant. What? Yep. Are you really? I am. Eight weeks. Not planned. Obviously. <laughs> so as you could see, the pregnancy was a little bit of a shock for all of us. Not as much of a shock as Isaiah, but still was not expecting it whatsoever. It has been a long while since I have picked up the camera. Um, I wanted to end this video and post it a lot sooner but I have been extremely sick extremely exhausted um, I thought less than last time but Jeff says this time has definitely been more and the fact that I was working last time I was still able to go to work if I had a job this time I'm pretty sure I would lose it because there's no way I could have gone I've been so sick I'm now to the point where that is starting to lessen I'm into my second trimester still dealing with the sickness of course I dealt with it until my third trimester with Isaiah so that's kind of what I'm expecting but like I said it has lessened I'm still throwing up but not nearly as intense not nearly as often like I had a two-day stretch where I didn't throw up at all two whole days in a row it was great um, that broke last night I ended up throwing up but regardless it was better so that's good tomorrow I actually have another ultrasound and this ultrasound um, last time is when we found out that Isaiah was a boy 
So if this one is a boy, there is a possibility of us finding it out. If it is a girl, then it has to wait till later. And also it could be later if it's a boy too. I did do the genetic testing, so we will get a call on the gender as well. But that's not for another at least three to four weeks for us to even find that out. But obviously I'll let you know what the gender is. Not quite sure how I want to do that. If I want to do something or just be like, hey, here it is. So we'll see. But this is going to end this video. Today is October 31st, so I am vlogging today. So stay tuned for that video. Hopefully I'll have it up soon. Um, with the fact that I have been super exhausted, it's really hard for me to find time to edit. But I am going to try and get it up as soon as I can. Um, I'm not going to have any kind of schedule whatsoever with videos just because I do ugh, just any kind of normalcy is out the window still at this point. But yeah, so uh, thank you for watching and God bless.